Two giants of football going head to head today. The stadium is full and everyone is excited and ready for this one. Join us for all the action next on EA TV. A warm welcome to the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium, where we're all set for rivalry North London style. I'm Guy Mowbray with Sue Smith alongside me for commentary on Spurs versus Arsenal. Sue, you can feel the excitement here. Oh, you can, and what a game this promises to be. There's certainly no love lost between the two sides. With Spurs being at home, you'd expect them to take the game to Arsenal maybe a little bit, try and get that early goal, but I'm really looking forward to this one. This is the home side's team today. Yeah, it's a 4-5-1, but it will morph into a 4-2-3-1. The single centre forward will be supported by the number 10, and you'd expect them to rotate and swap positions just to try and drag defenders out. The wide midfielders, they'll offer a threat in behind. And it's been ruled offside. He must have known that he was offside, so surely you've just got to let that run. This is how Arsenal line up. Declan Rice plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. Oh, a really poor challenge. What's the referee going to do here? An early yellow card. Well, that might set the tone. He yeah, needs to be a bit smarter there so early on in the game to get booked. May change how he approaches the rest of the game. Read the pass well and cuts it out. It's scrappy, it lacks flow, someone has to take charge here. Well, in that sort of position, you simply have to get it closer than he did there. Spurs have the ball again. Werner. Son's ability to finish and his link-up play make him the perfect strike partner. Is he going to play a prominent role in this game? Well, that sort of form speaks for itself, doesn't it? To score three goals in his last three matches, he must be full of confidence. All the best trying to keep him quiet. The approach play looked encouraging. But good defending to snuff out any threat. Spurs recovering possession well. James Madison. Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And that's a shame for them, nothing doing. Gabriel Martinelli. Now, this might be promising. Pulls it back. Went for it, and it wasn't a bad try. It's been hammered just wide. Good tackle results in a throw-in. Timo Werner. Well, certainly wasn't a clean tackle. Might go in the book here. And the name has been taken for that. It's silly, isn't it? Has to go in the book for that. Referee playing advantage. He's beaten his marker here. 
Madison. Oh, he caught that with everything he's got, but it's missed the target, only just too high. William Saliba played to Gabriel. Oh, that's been won really smartly. Well, a few protestations, but nothing doing. Play continues. Tackle to break up the play. Lovely ball. This could lead to something. Looking to put the cross in. The defense does its work. Bisuma. Timo Werner. Werner. Merino. Spurs come away with it. Now he's already been booked once. This could be trouble. And there it is, the second yellow card. You can see what the manager thinks of that. He'll be fuming with him. He can't do that when he's already on a yellow. Danger averted for now. Martinelli. They're not getting close enough here. Nice pass and on their march. But a good bit of defending to stop it. Goes for goal! Oh, and he's tried to power that in. That's flown over the bar. to continue very quick to close down there could be something building here for Arsenal and they've got it back now Eve Bissouma and the pass is incomplete nicely won counter attack coming away they go the counter fizzling out in the end. Good ball in behind. And stopped in their tracks. Well watched. And with that, the first half comes to an end here in Tottenham. Well, the performance of Son today needs a little bit of work. He's got to get involved a little bit more than he has been. How would you rate him, Sue? He's not really been himself in the first half. He's hardly had a touch. We all know the quality that he's got and the fact that he can win a game on his own. I'm sure we're going to see a better second half performance from him. Off we go for the second half with nothing to separate them. Madison.
possession lost. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. A chance to cross here. And he's got that one away. And the very best of the Premier League keeps on coming for you on EA TV. Spurs face, and that, to me, looked a nasty one. But what does the ref think? Yellow card, and the referee just having a word. Now, well, one or two players just losing their heads a little. They need to calm down. Cover possession. Good vision. Saka. Having a try. Blocked for now. Untidy in possession there. Great reading of the game by the man in goal. Madison. Bissouma. Dejan Kulisevsky. Destiny Odogi. Son Hyung Min. Lovely, incisive ball. This has to be. And the keeper has done his job, but it was made simple for him. Well, the stats don't lie, do they? They just haven't created enough clear cut chances, and you can see they're starting to get frustrated. They'll know that they're not playing up to the standard expected. You just feel they need to impose themselves a bit more in the game. Well, EA TV is your home of the Premier League. 
and we've got more on the way as Arsenal face Manchester City. Another match for your viewing pleasure. Yeah, it's one I'm looking forward to. Always a great atmosphere. Kulusevski. Madison. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Kulusevski. Down nicely and in. Gabriel Martinelli. Could be a chance to break here. Marino. Sent into the middle. Not the end to the move they were looking for. And a good tackle results in a throw-in. James Madison. Good work to regain possession. Well, that was a firm one, but it seems a fair one. It's all a bit too crammed in the thick of it here. And it's opened up for him. And he's done really well to keep that out. And the goalkeeper has got it back in his grasp. Well, he's certainly relieved he could gather that, but what a brilliant initial save. Struggling to keep the ball there. Promising looking attack building here for Arsenal. Havertz! And that's a great bit of goalkeeping. That's what he's there for. comes out of play throw in to come Dejan Kulusevski Timo Werner Horro Bentoncourt chance to win the game here and that's where it ends what a chance here brilliant work by the man in goal that's a top stop and a kick played in oh great work from the keeper to avert the danger Martinelli. Well, what an atmosphere inside here. The fans are really getting behind them. They want to win this as much as the players. There's so little time left now. James Madison. Oh, if they score from this, they'll surely win the game. It was a decent attempt, but the wait for a goal goes off. It does, but you can't fault their effort. You just feel they have to take one of these chances now. Well, yes, he did see it. It's going to be a booking. I like how the ref allowed play to go on there, made the right decision in the end. James Madison. Look promising, but threat averted. So that's it. It's ended goalless, which all...
If you're looking for a high-level encounter with real meaning, you've come to the right place. Two teams who symbolize success and both with huge followings about to cross paths. Stay tuned for Manchester City against Arsenal next on EA TV. And a warm welcome. Our venue today is the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Manchester City up against Arsenal. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Nathan Ake plays alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence. Rodri plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Declan Rice starts alongside Marino in central midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Raheem Sterling. And they kick off here. Kai Havertz. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Walker. De Bruyne. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. And making high pressing work for them here. Really clever pressing. Goalkeeper gets it in the way. Superb save. Playing it short. I'm trying to build ahead of steam. Another corner of the beat. being a goal, didn't it? Sterling! Oh, a powerful effort. Close.
Walker. The ball with Rodri. Well, Arsenal badly want to win this game after drawing in the last match against Spurs. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Well, I think they'll be a little bit disappointed with that result. But if they show a little bit more energy going forward today, they can certainly win this one. As you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. So City get the match restarted. Can they come up with an equaliser having conceded? Given away by City. Can he find the right pass? Distributing it well. No possibilities in the centre. It's there for him. Well, the header was respectable, but the goalkeeper always seemed to have it covered. Gundogan. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. And a throw in for Arsenal. Promising pass. Goal kick is what's coming up here. Gundogan. The ball with Rodri. Regained possession. Kai Havertz. Real chance. position well as you can see he beats the defender so easily with a change of pace and then it's a decent finish that's a very good goal you have to say so underway again and a 2-0 advantage here Sterling. Marino. Determined defending. Now counter attacking possibilities. A good vision there. Saka. It's with Mikel Marino. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Oh, this looks useful. Really good build-up, but no end product. Throw into Manchester City.
and played the pass well. William Saliba. Mikel Marino. Rice with it. Well cleared away. Really fine play to keep possession. He's given us away. And David Raya has it now. Kai Havertz. Attacking possibilities on the flank for City here. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Chances on. Still possibilities. And not hitting it with the accuracy he was hoping for. Well, he took a chance there and he probably regrets it now. That was the wrong decision. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Wasteful from Arsenal. Is this the moment? And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, Erling Haaland not nearly as influential as we've come to expect, Stuart. Well, he has to find space in more dangerous areas. He's such a good player around the box, but today he struggled to get on the ball, and that's one of the reasons they're losing here. Off and running again as we reflect upon an eye-catching first-half display from Arsenal. Offside the decision. Manuel Akanji. An effective challenge. Well, not pretty, but very gritty. Kai Havertz. That is how to keep it out of the net. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Manchester City taking on Newcastle United. Gundogan really fine piece of defending play to break us up good ball to switch the play and quick thinking defensively and Kai Havertz Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And not cleared away properly. Oh, good work by the keeper.
and Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 10, Jack Grealish, coming onto the pitch. Number 20, Bernardo Silva. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not the best clearance. Trossard. And here's Gabriel. Saka. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Well, a really dominant performance so far from Kai Havertz. Not that that comes as a huge surprise. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance. And he's not finished just yet. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Arsenal taking on Leicester City. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. But it is a yellow card for accumulation of offences. Well, it was only a matter of time. He's been on the edge for quite a while now. Get past his man. What a commitment to defending. <laughs> Put in by De Bruyne. A goal! He's dispatched it. Much to the sheer delight of the fans. Who's the first person they want to celebrate with? It's Pep Guardiola. What a lovely moment that is. So back underway. 3-1 the score. Sterling. And a textbook interception. Rodri. Gundogan. The ball with Rodri. And a timely intervention. He has teammates around him. And Kai Havertz. Now unable to bend his run offside. Gvardiol. The ball with Rodri. A bit wasteful from City. Really good build up, but no end product. satisfied it was a clean challenge well not making life difficult for the keeper at all a wide attempt and this might not be the ideal situation for them well it looks so promising but a goal kick the outcome Gundogan, a very effective challenge put in. Sterling, oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. <laughs> Over it comes. Well, not away properly. Saka. Struggling to get it away. Rice. And hit with ferocity. Well, we gave it the big build-up, but he didn't quite deliver on his promise. Rodri. Walker.
as you can see, he nearly puts it over the top, but it ends up being a very good finish. No chance for the keeper. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Tossar. And here's Saliba. Perfect tackle. And offside it is. A change in the offing for City. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And a strong tackle. Could be threatening. Now the conclusion, he's missed the opportunity. Under some pressure. Arsenal regaining possession. This could be it! And it is! He's done it! Surely a case of game over! Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Saka. It's opening up for them. Can he find the net? Oh, a really crisp effort, but just wide. Determined block. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Thomas Partey. Martinelli. Can he play it in? Corner kick given to Arsenal. And over it comes. Real chance. Strong hand on that one. Needs to tread carefully. Havertz! And now it is official. The referee brings this match to an end. And it's a victory for the Gunners. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.
Sterling. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. the breakthrough that will do nicely well possibilities in the centre it's there for him well the header was respect real chance and it's gone in for Arsenal will they be stopped from this position Still possibilities. And not hitting it with the accuracy he was. Is this the moment? And he scored not once but twice. They simply. Good work by the keeper. Put in by De Bruyne. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Sterling. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Opportunity for them to get back into the game. Oh, another goal! You just cannot keep them down. And a strong tackle. Could be threatening. Well, the conclusion, he's missed the opportunist. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Can he find the net? Oh, a... 